Well, Liam, not a bad way to start 2023. A goal and a victory. Just talk us through the performance, first of all. Yeah, uh, obviously, Thursday night wasn't good enough. We had to. We knew we had to bounce back from that. Um, and I think we probably by the first 20 minutes where I thought they were a little bit on top. Once they had the break, I thought we came out after that and thought we, we were brilliant. Um, especially second half, we were on top. Uh, conceding the goal and we sat back a little bit too much of what we have liked, but um, I think we defended brilliantly today and uh, I think we deserve the three points. I see that first goal came at a good time just before half-time. You know, did you feel like the team grew into the game as it went on? Because I think once that first goal came... Started second half brilliantly. The team had their tails up, didn't they? Yeah, I mean, DJ took his goal well. Um, like he does it in training, and like I say, after we got the goal, I thought we, we were on top for most of the game. Bar in the last 10, 15 minutes, where I thought we dropped off a little bit, allowed pressure onto us. But I thought, like I said, we defended really well, uh, defended the goal, and uh, like I say, it's a great win. It's been the season of rare goal scorers, but I think the only one missing was a, a Liam Kinsella goal. We we finally got that today. Um, first of all, just Getting on the score sheet, how, how, how does that feel? Because I think it's been your first one in three years and your first league goal since October 2015. Yeah, we don't have to say that. Um, I mean, uh, yeah, it's fantastic to get on the score sheet. I think everyone was shocked as much as I was, to be fair. But we spoke at half-time. Hats, I owe it to him, to be fair. He's up a set-piece routine. Um, Hutch put a fantastic ball in and I was there to head it. Top bins. <laughs> Matt Sadler actually mentioned... Wayne Hatswell and the set piece, and that's obviously where the goals come from. Just how much detail goes into that, you know, on the training pitch and on a match day as well? Yeah, he works his socks off, um, gives us two, three set pieces a game to, to work on. And like I said, at half time, he, he pulled a couple of boys to sort out a set piece, and it came off perfectly. Um, like I said, it was a great ball in by Hutch. The, the ball's not there, the goal's not there. And like I say, he works his socks off to get the set pieces out to the lads, and thankfully it paid off today. You've been practising headers because that was a bullet header from yourself. <laughs> uh, I think I might as well start shooting my head now, rather than my feet. <laughs> yeah. And um, that's it. It's you know it's a bounce back from the defeat to Stockport. Have we seen exactly what the team is about? Because you know they've been on a good run, haven't they? All all throughout October, November. But at times in previous seasons, perhaps the team would suffer a defeat and be a little run. But it, that, that's not the case today. Have we seen what the team is about today? Yeah, we said we, we had a meeting on Friday. We said we got a bounce back. We've had a fantastic run last nine, ten games, and it was just a setback. It was one one of them games where we weren't at it. Um, we allowed to stop put too much. And we knew we had to bounce back, and today we saw that. And like I said, it's a, a big three points because it puts us up the table and close to the playoffs. And that's it, close to the playoffs. But take a pause from the league for the FA Cup. Team will go re- into it with a lot of confidence. You know, a lot of lads got an opportunity today. Oshin and the the two strikers as well coming in for DJ who couldn't play against his parent club. So. You know, everyone seems to be in a really buoyant mood and that's perfect to head into a, a massive FA Cup tie. Yeah, it's a big big FA Cup third round against Stockport. Lads that came in today were outstanding. Um, and it probably gives the gaffer a headache for next week with putting their performances. Um, but that's what the gaffer would like, headaches. Um, and we got to go to Stockport next Sunday and put in a, a performance and try and, get, try and get through to the fourth round in the FA Cup.